Hi guys! So this is just going to be a collective haul. I went shopping today with my friend and the main reason why I went is because it's my friend's birthday on Saturday and I hadn't bought her anything. So I went and fixed that. I also got some stuff for myself because I can't go shopping without getting stuff for myself. Uh, but also I have been shopping, well shopping and shopping, it's not really shopping, I bought like two one thing or something but whatever um before and with my dad and I just got a wet and wild you can see that wet and wild kabuki this is really really big and it's awesome at buffing in your powder so I've been using this kind of religiously lately I love it okay and now on to today's shopping the first thing H&M had this awesome sale where all their old makeup collections were 50% off. This body lotion from their in Devils and Angels collection. And this is in Pomegranate Berries. And I'll just read off of it. Moisturizing body lotion to give the skin a soft, fresh feeling. I think I got some on my nose right now, but whatever. This smells awesome I really love it okay and then uh, same collection they've had these lip gloss trios but it just comes in this box and there you can see the 50% off tag and that's the back it's really pretty it's the kitty angel and devil lip gloss kit and the colors are pink can you see that no shimmer no anything I love it it's very neutral, medium tone pink. This is light pink. And by the way, pink, the first one, is an angel. So pink and light pink are angel tones. But then we have dark pink, that's a devil tone. You can see that? And uh, light pink and dark pink are shimmery. I'm not too into that. Well, not, not shimmery, they're glittery. These just have like chunks of glitter. You can see that. And so that's this. Um, but yeah, I think I'll accept them anyway. I might f have a f hard time finding anything to do with this, but I know I will be using these two religiously. And then I also get two eyeshadow palettes. The first one, you guys know how much I love the Angel Eyes palette that I have from this collection. So when I saw the Devil Eyes, being on sale, I got that too. And this just, ah, uh, this just contains a purplish brown burgundy, a purple, a dark blue, dark green, medium tuned corally pink. What's this? It's like a bit of a salmon color neutral pink, and just a champagne. And I really like this pot, so, and it goes great with my angel eyes, so it just looks like there's a thought behind it, which it's not really. I just happen to love the first one, so I got the second one. And then also this, which I'm very excited about. This eyeshadow palette. You can see that. It's the Vintage Glamour. It contains 12 colors. It comes with two sponge tip applicators. I don't use those, so I usually just keep them in the palette. This is like a skin toned glittery color. This is like a beige off white color. This is a dark purple brown burgundy ish. I really love that color. This is an orange. This is like a medium brown. A skin colored ish yellow. Switch fingers. A medium tone pink. A very cool purple. That's pretty much that's pretty much the colors. Uh, this I really like and this I really like. It's like almost a black with like gold glitter, but it's not really that. A brown, dark brown, uh, a grey, and a glittery black. And I'm really happy with this. I mean, 12 colors for as little as it was. I think it was originally 
60 crowns and then I got this for 30 but it could also have been that it was originally 50 and I got it for 25 anyway cheap to cheap um, this was either three or four dollars and then another thing that I'm very excited about trying out is because Kubus right now in uh, Tessentralen has um, I'm just gonna take this in Swedish like I always do um, Kubus i Tessentralen har just nu såhär utförsäljning på allt sitt smink för att de ska lägga ner den avdelningen så att även de här grejerna var på halva priset och jag tror resten var typ utsålt för det var fanns liksom inte mer um, Dalia Takerte <laughs> This is from Makeup Factory and there's my camera if you can see that it's really pretty, it's a quad and it comes with obviously four since it is a quad <laughs> would have been really stupid otherwise a creamy off white skin toned-ish um, medium brown <clears throat> and then a darker reddish brown now my voice is cracked and this uh, quad comes with a bit of a mirror here that I'm gonna work on keeping clean because I always mess them up and then a sponge tip applicator and basically what I was disappointed about was the sponge tip applicator because this company is pretty you know high standard and I would have trouble seeing them actually sitting along sponge tip applicators that's just not happening um that's just stupid to me but yeah I'm really excited about this it's extremely pigmented so that's great and then also um this is sort of fun thing for me there's an OPI an OPI freak um, Kix right now has the uh, has just gotten in the Hong Kong collection from OPI but they had these brochures from OPI and it's like basically the Hong Kong collection. You can see that it says Hong Kong collection by OPI and then it has a Hong Kongish woman. But the thing is that first if you open it there's a text about Hong Kong and the collection. Then there's the collection. By the way, I'll just point out which colors it is that I want from this. I want Meet Me on the Star Ferry. I want Dim Sum Plum. And I want Pandemonium Pink. And I would, I know my friend um, who's watching this would die to have Jadis the New Black. So, yeah, we really like that collection, actually. It's awesome. And I would love to have Lucky Lucky Lavender, too. Whatever. Um, and then in this brochure, they also include their classics. So there's like an entire spread about their classic colors. And then there's also um, a description thingy over the classics, Hong Kong collection, soft shades, and brights. And I love their brights. I have one from them. And then there's a little, a little fashion feng shui. Um, then you get to the brights. And I love all the brights. The one that I have is in the corner there. It's No Room for the Blues. And that's my favorite nail polish of all time. No Room for the Blues by OPI. This is my favorite nail polish. By the way, a nail polish collection video is coming up. I'm going to film it and I'm not going to be lazy about it. That's awesome, right? And then I was at the brights. And then there are also the soft shades. So, um, this will come in handy. I'll just put it in my nail drawer. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this haul. If you did, please subscribe over in the sidebar. I've learned that this camera, it's that way. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.